had it like this. <laughs> Thanks for checking out my human formation page. Here you'll find a few different ways that I've grown over my last four years. My affective and effective maturity. The way I handle myself, the way I grow, the way I take care of myself. And also the way I relate with others. There's a few different ways I've done that through formation, through classes, and through relationships. My freshman year, I had a class on psychology, and I wrote a paper on self-congruency. It really opened my eyes to the importance of, of, of me accepting myself as I am, embracing the gifts that I have, and, and nurturing the, the unique little quirks that, that God gave me to make me who I am. Another individual um, aspect of, of my person uh, that, that I've that I grown to enjoy and accept more came through another psychology class my sophomore year. I wrote a paper on the importance of exercise and how that not only benefits the, the physiological person but also the psychological and emotional person. Another way that I've grown in my time here has been through Hispanic ministry. Um, although we'll talk more about that in pastoral ministry, it's, um, one of the ways I've grown in this is, has been through playing guitar at the masses that we celebrate in Spanish here and in the local parishes, as well as learning the Spanish language. That's been challenging, but it's opened my eyes, opened my heart up to a whole other culture, a whole other uh, diverse group of people. I hope to be a priest one day, and if I am, um, I can't be a priest for just a few select people that I feel comfortable serving, but I have to be a priest to all people. Sometimes that means stepping out of the, the comfortable walls of my, my own culture, my own environment, in order to better serve those that the Lord has called me to serve. Um, and I've truly embraced this uh, the, the undertaking of learning Spanish, embracing the Hispanic culture. Over half the Catholics in my home diocese, the diocese is a little rock in Hispanic. So that's a reality that I will be facing, just as most of the seminarians will be when they go back to their dioceses. Another area of human formation that I've really enjoyed has been through the building of the bonfire. I've taken part in helping build this, my time on the farm growing up, and also my time in the United States Air Force serving, uh, working in logistics, has um, allowed me to contribute a few different talents and gifts to this undertaking, this, this building of the bonfire. Last year and this year, Brian Phillips and myself um, planned and coordinated this build, and it's been great um, growing in relationship with Brian, one of my, my best friends here, um, and we got to share that, that common love of, of hard work, dedication, and nature through building the bonfire. Additionally, I served as MC for Abbey Youth Fest last year, 2011 and this year 2012 which truly pulled me out of my comfort zone in front of over 3,000 people youth and adults volunteers uh, truly um, truly truly helped me to, to grow in the area that the formation has encouraged me to grow as more as a public person also I served the community this last year my senior year as student government president I was elected by my peers at the end of my junior year to serve them in this capacity anyhow enough of my talk and I'll get back to some music Take a look around. Tell me what you think.